Same game, I just switched my position. Hoping the young nigga really gon' listen. James Harden, where I play my position. James Harden, where I play my position. What's happening? Cool Cat Crew, it's your man, man, Lionheart. Welcome back to the Lions Den. Rawr. So today on the channel, we finally, after days of them being sold out, checking to see if they got it again, we'll go into multiple locations. Popeye's chicken sandwiches sold out. $23 million sold in the past three days. Crazy numbers. And if you've been sleep under a rock somewhere, or maybe you just don't have social media, for those of you who don't know, and even if you do know, they have been beefing, no pun intended because of chicken sandwiches, super hard. Okay? It started off Chick-fil-A saying, original chicken sandwich, we had the first, we the best, you know what I'm saying? And then Popeye subtweeted and said, y'all good? When I subtweeted, they tweeted at them, captioning the picture, da 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 da, y'all good? Next thing you know, we got a battle of the chicken sandwiches. Some people try to bring Wendy's into it, and then we're not even going to mention why Burger King tried to get into it. Yeah. Um, but, for those of you who don't know, Popeye's, this isn't Popeye's first time having a chicken sandwich. If y'all don't remember the po' boy back in the early 2000s, the chicken po' boy, y'all sleep, y'all tripping, y'all really can't call yourselves Popeye heads. But, we are going to be trying... Uh, a taste test of the Popeye's original chicken sandwich right here, the Chick-fil-A original chicken sandwich, the Popeye's spicy chicken sandwich, and Chick-fil-A spicy chicken sandwich, all right? So I'm going to go ahead and start off with, the, of course, one of the main reasons why I'm doing this video, the it's not like burnt bread. It's okay. Cool. The Popeye's chicken sandwich. Get a little close up on that. Okay. So first off, it comes in like this wax paper, and we're gonna see what's on. Well, first off, I need some. Let me see some. Because first off, so uh, I had to get my napkins and everything in order. Go ahead and slide them right there. So we can dissect this thing. So I think, I, yeah, this is the top. Got like a nice brioche bun on top. And then if you take off the top, you got slightly toasted. And then you got the chicken patty. And then you got pickles at the bottom. Y'all see that? It smells like, I don't know if it's dill or, or the butter pickles. But uh, anyway. Doing what we came here to do. Popeye's chicken sandwich going down the gullet in three, two, one. Okay. Okay. Not bad. I'm going to tell you guys what I think about everything at the end of the review. So that was the original Popeye's chicken sandwich. Now we're gonna be trying their spicy chicken sandwich. Now I do like a little bit of flavor with my food, so. Yeah. Okay, you see a little redness to it, a little spices and stuff, before we even take it out the, the wrapper. So. 
So, as you can see, you see some of that sauce on there. Okay. I'm thinking it's like maybe a spicy mayonnaise or something. All right, well, only one way to find out, right? Popeye's spicy chicken sandwich going down the gullet in three, two, one. Spice hits you first before anything. Wow, and it just grows. Try to get a little bit more of the sauce. Not so much the pickle. That was, that had some spice to it. I ain't gonna lie. Mm. Okay. Now, let's get a Chick-fil-A, okay? Got the Chick-fil-A classic chicken sandwich. Ooh. Now, I ain't even gonna lie to y'all. This is definitely one of my go-tos at Chick-fil-A. Just simple. You know what I'm saying? Got the pickles. Nothing on the bun. Keeping it plain. A lot of chicken. Hi, Frisky. You know, you can't have any chicken. Chick-fil-A chicken sandwich. Original chicken sandwich. Going down the gullet in three, two, one. more bite. Okay. Now, <clears throat> last but certainly not least, the Chick-fil-A spicy chicken sandwich. Whoop, drop some chicken now. I see that. Miss OG. Once again, it's just like the original chicken sandwich. Nothing on the bun. Oh, you see the amount of spice on that chicken, though. And then you got pickles at the bottom. You know what I'm saying? So, hey, boy. Get, get, get down. One second, y'all. It don't even, the top ain't on. It don't scare him no more. He don't even care. <sighs> anyway. Chick-fil-A spicy chicken sandwich going down in three, two, one. It's been a minute since I had Chick-fil-A spicy chicken sandwich. Damn 
All right. So we have officially tried all of the chicken sandwiches. I'm going to start off with the Popeye's chicken sandwich. Not bad. I see what they're doing. And truthfully, neither one of these are bad. And honestly, neither one of them are better. In my opinion, this is this is my opinion. Um, so with the Popeye's chicken sandwich, imagine their chicken tenders big, right? Like a big chicken breast. That's truthfully what it is. It's just a it's their boneless chicken, but bigger. Brioche bun. Slap some mayonnaise on it. Put some pickles on it. Here's your sandwich. It's really good. I can tell the seasoning in the chicken, but um, it's it's just like if I were to put their boneless chicken on a bun. Um, not saying it was underwhelming. It was a good sandwich, but I, it was just a, a a good chicken sandwich. Like that's truthfully all I can say. It's better than. McDonald's chicken sandwiches is better than Burger King chicken sandwiches. Better, in my opinion, better than Wendy's chicken sandwiches. So, it was just a grade A chicken sandwich. Now, their spicy chicken sandwich. Imagine the original chicken sandwich with spicy mayonnaise on it. But, like, a little bit hotter than spicy mayonnaise. Like, really, like, somewhat of a, a, a nice spice type of, sti of spicy mayonnaise. It definitely, that's the first thing that you taste when you bite into the spicy chicken sandwich, is, is that a, initial kick. You know what I'm saying? Um, so, out of all the, the Popeye's chicken sandwich experience, I'm gonna give it a, I'm gonna give it a seven out of 10, okay? It wasn't overwhelming. Um, all the hype made me feel like this was gonna be one of the best chicken sandwiches I've ever tasted. And to me, it was just a good quality chicken sandwich. It was, it was like, hey, you know, it's a good chicken sandwich. That's all I'm gonna say. I'll say I'll say what I was about to say for last. Let's go to Chick Fil A. I would like to assume that most of us have had a Chick Fil A chicken sandwich original, um, and it's good. You know, they fry it and well, they cook it in peanut oil. Um, the grated chicken tastes really quality, good. But once again, I know I'm talking about Chick Fil A, but Popeye's chicken. Tasted very quality as well. Like it was a good quality of chicken. Higher quality than, uh, you know, Wendy's or, of course, Burger King. And definitely, of course, McDonald's. But uh, it was a quality, quality chicken breast. Uh, but Chick fil A's chicken sandwich, it, something about that peanutty, sweet, or I don't, I don't know if it's coconut oil that they cook in or what, but it's like when you bite into it, it's a sweet and savory taste, which is I'm a huge fan of. And apparently, a lot of people are, you know, big fans of that. So, I would, you know, it's it's a, it's a, it's the top chicken sandwich. You know what I'm saying? Not in this category, but I'm just saying, like, out of all the chicken sandwiches, it's really, really good. They've really perfected their craft. They've really done a great job at what they do. Okay? This is what they specialize in. Um, the spicy chicken sandwich was, a, in my opinion, a little bit better than their original chicken sandwich. I've had both before, but I like a little spice with my food. So it's definitely, it's like a sweet spice. So it's like a sweet chili chicken, but without having the sweet chili flavor. Um, and for those, um, you know, chicken sandwiches, I'll also get those a 7 out of 10. You know what I'm saying? There's no sauce on it. It's just bread, pickles, chicken. You know what I'm saying? Um, so as a whole summary, these are, these chicken sandwiches are extremely similar in every bit of the sense. Like, some people, I don't know, in my opinion, they just taste very similar. They both have grade A chicken. They both have grade A spices and seasonings. Um, I feel like Popeye's went a little bit too heavy on the mayonnaise. But then again, sometimes I feel like Chick-fil-A chicken sandwiches can be dry at some point in time. You got to pour the whatever sauce that you like on top. The spicy chicken sandwich at Popeye's was more spice than flavor. So like I said, you just taste heat and you don't really taste the flavoring. And the spicy chicken sandwich at Chick-fil-A once again, it'd be nice to have some type of sauce on there. They will let you like say, hey, what sauce would you like on the chicken sandwich? And they put it on the chicken sandwich for you. They can do it that way. But I will say this. On a Sunday when Chick-fil-A is closed, 
I'm going to Popeyes. I'm not going to Wendy's. I'm not going to Burger King, of course. I'm definitely not going to uh, McDonald's. I'm going to take my black butt, butt to Popeyes. Okay? They have the better quality chicken sandwich out of out of excluding Chick-fil-A. If we're just talking about the other restaurants, McDonald's, Burger King, uh, Wendy's, they have the better chicken sandwich than those other three chains. Okay? So like I said, on a Sunday, Chick-fil-A closed. I'm going to Popeye's, all right? It was definitely an experience. Um, you guys definitely got to try it. Let me know what you guys think about it in the comment section below. If you guys like it, if you are rocking with it, if you are going to go to Popeye's more than you going to Chick-fil-A now, or if you're like, uh, whatever. It's whatever you feel like. Let me know how y'all feel about it in the comment section below. But thank you guys for checking out my taste testing video. Make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe. Become part of the Cool Cat Crew, the Cool Channel on YouTube. You know your mom knows, you know your family knows, the whole world knows it. We going up all 2019 and beyond. I will see you guys in another video. This is Lionheart signing out. Remember, L-O-E until you D-I-E. Good, good, go!